What's cracking YouTube? My name's Brody and welcome to episode number 12 of our Pokemon Y Wonderlock that's been going down on the channel as of late. So in the last episode what we did was we cleared Snorlax off the bridge as Snorlax was blocking our pathway. Uh, we went to traded Snorlax off. We did manage to catch Snorlax by the way. I uh, wanted to trade that one off and we got a shield on which is pretty sweet That was a pretty powerful one to trade if I don't say so myself uh, But then we continued along route 7 We got introduced to the daycare and then we just passed the battle chateau here after battling a couple of trainers Then we got into a double battle with our friends, which was pretty cool Pretty cool, but then we ended up right where we are right now at this little photo spot, which is kind of cool outside the connecting cave but before we go into the connecting cave I I just remembered that we have an encounter in the grass here as you guys may or may not know Snorlax was a bonus encounter it's like a special event encounter so it doesn't count as the encounter for the route if that makes sense so let's pick up this item we got a PPR nice and let's get this encounter and kick off today's episode with an encounter I think I've said encounter like four times. I need to, need to stop. But we've got a Krogon. I wonder if Krogon will have any fighting type moves. And I'm paralyzed as well, so that's not good. I probably should have checked that. Do I want to fake out? Oof, uh, we're level 22, so... <laughs> I don't know. Let's just go bite and see what happens. At least we can't get... Poison because we're already paralyzed, so that's something, I guess. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I bet it's had battle animations on. I think that's low enough. I don't want to go any lower because I don't want to kill or make Krogan paint. So, let's see if we can get this capture. Shouldn't be too hard way over level in, in comparison to the Pokemon in, on this route, so there we go, first Pokeball, pretty pleased, pretty pleased with that, we get another one to trade, cool, so Krogunk, the toxic mouth Pokemon, inflating its poison sacks, it fills the area with an odd sound and hits flinching opponents with a poison jab. Okay. So what should we call Krogunk? Krogunk. I don't I really don't know. I don't know what to call Krogunk. Because we called Vanipede Poisopede. And we called Snorlax Fatty. So what kind of fits this stupid trend? Let's just go like I don't, I don't know actually, we're not, we're not even going to bother, this is going to take too long for me to think of a interesting retarded nickname like I usually do. So let's just move on from that. And Wonder Trade. So let's get down here. Yeah, I usually like to try to give them funny nicknames so the person receiving them will get a nice little kick out of it, but I just can't think of anyone. So yeah, there's Dino Clear, the shield on, the French shield on. So we've got a lax natured dry skin crow gunk with astonish, mud slap, poison sting, and taunt. So you're gone. And let's see what we can get today. So it's level 14. So if we get anything under that, we can always boost it up with the rare candies. Hopefully the internet doesn't cut out or anything stupid. I've been having issues with it all day as I usually do. It goes like, it wants to go fast and then it goes slow and then right now it's going slow. So we will see, we'll see what happens. Find a trade partner already, god damn it. Because yeah, we're coming up to the second gym, which is a rock type gym. So we need water, we need grass, we need fighting. So Krogunk would have been perfect. But cool, so here, Torchic's for... Oh, Tor Torchic. From Brendan in Australia, Queensland. My boy in Queensland. That's where I'm from if you guys did not know. So my boy coming through. 
with the Torchic. You already know we got a Torchic. Yo, check that, guys. <laughs> we got some starter power right here. I'm guessing he's playing Alpha Sapphire or Omega Ruby. Going off the name, Brendan being the boy character. I'm guessing they went pretty mainstream. But that's solid. Just before we check this Torchic, let's just throw battle animations back on. Confirm. And then let's have a look at this Torchic that we received. Because obviously, if it's Torchic's for all, it's a bread Torchic. I'm hoping. I'm hoping, I'm hoping. Okay, so it is a bread Torchic, but there's no, like, egg moves or anything on it. Um, but it is speed boost, which is pretty good. Um, it's adamant, even better. So that ups attack and lowers special attack. I'm, I'm totally cool with that. But yeah. I don't nature it from a faraway place. Not even bad, you guys. So I'm going to have a quick little fast forward section here while I level up Torchic to level 14. Because as you guys know, we traded off a Krogunt that was level 14. So we want to get equal kind of leveled trade back in return. So I'll see you guys in a sec. Alrighty guys, and we're back, so Torchic is now, uh, get out of the bag. Torchic is now level 14, as I was just about to say before I got interrupted by a misclick. Um, so throughout the leveling, we got, uh, we learnt Focus Energy and Ember, and we haven't evolved, because I think Evolution's like level 16 or something like that. But, um, cool, so I'm gonna leave Torchic in the party for now. Just because it's like, I don't know, we've got the spare spot. And the next gym leader does have an Aurorus, which, I don't know, double fire, having Ponyta and Torchic could be somewhat helpful. But who knows. Um, so what's down this way? So I think Connecting Cave has two entrances, if I remember. What would we got here? Another crew gun. yeah, we want to make our way through to the next town. we got to get some progress going in today's episode. Whoops. Should probably throw a rappel up. <laughs> probably be the smart thing. Let's get out of here. So where are these rappels at? Perfecto. Now we can wander freely. There we go. So we got a tiny mushroom. What's this? A person. Person berry. So what entrance? I think it's the bottom entrance we need to go through. From what I remember. As you guys may or may not know, it has been a long time since I played this game. Can you hear me? Yes, you can. I, I remember. I remember. I totally did not realize that it was someone that could heal you when I was first playing through. I kind of just didn't get healed, and I had to go all. I kept going all the way back to the closest Pokemon Center, whichever one it was. I can't even remember. Damn. So well on Route Eight. Oh dang, who's this? Stop right there. Oh, Di Dino and... What's her name? Cena, I think. D Dino and Cena. Ah ha We didn't mean to surprise you. How are you and Kangaskhan doing? Yeah, pretty good, mate. Pretty good. Haven't you wondered... Haven't you wondered... Wondered... Wondered how a single Pokedex could possibly cover a region as big as Kalos? Well, it can't. That's why we are here to power up your Pokedex. Ah, cool. Awesome. Thank you, Sycamore's assistance. Bon voyage. Also known as the mor morale. 
Moralcos. I can't. I, I'm not sure exactly how to pronounce that. Ooh, super potion, hidden items. You know how it is, guys. They wouldn't have that that for nothing. So I was like, I'd have to check. I have to check. So what is going on here? Oh no, what am I doing? Oh my god. I don't like puzzles like this. Okay. We got a HP up. I would have no clue what the best route to go. Oh dang. Okay, yeah. So I I think we went the right way, we avoided the grass. Dang, a horde. Is this our first encounter? This is our first encounter on Route 8. Dang, we have to... <laughs> we have to catch one of these, so let's knock them out one by one, because I think I, I asked on Twitter what you guys would do if you encountered a horde. Because I believe the rule says in the description, if you encounter one, uh, you're supposed to run away and then re-encounter it as a single encounter. Or, as one of the one of you guys mentioned on Twitter, was to knock them all out until there's one left and then catch that one. So, what I'm going to do is do it that way and knock them all out. I completely forgot about our encounter. And we got one in Connecting Cave as well. Did we run into something in Connecting Cave? I can't remember. I really can't remember. We will see. I'll, I'll have a look back and then we'll find out. But yeah, I'm totally, I'm totally just like zoned out right now. I completely forgot about this encounter. So let's keep chipping away without hitting ourselves in confusion, please and thank you. Come on, oh, Kangas Khan, please stop it. Oh, this is not good, guys. This is terrible. We have nothing that's special either. About time, Genghis Khan. Oh wow, our attack is so low. It should say that we, we can't get lowered anymore soon. I'm just gonna swap out, seriously. <laughs> seriously, this is terrible. Uh, let's go to... Let's go to Gibble. Oh, this is why I hate hordes, god damn it. This is this oh Okay. So yeah, our encounter for Route 8 is a wing goal. But we need to get rid of these. So let's go on that one. Come on, Gibble. Come on. Seriously. They all have supersonic, so it's like I snap out, I'm literally straight back confused. I'm using Dragon Rage because the growls will do nothing to me. Oh, why? Come on. These winkles, stop it. <laughs> Come on, Gibble. Yes, thank you. Bye bye. One more to go. I'm already confused. That does four. <laughs> Come on, Gibble. Why, why is this so like why is this such a struggle right now? I 
just don't know. Alrighty, so finally you guys, finally we're down to the last wing guy. Which puts me bait straight back into confusion. This is why nobody likes Wingull in Palabar, seriously. Should be an easy... It should be an easy capture, oh my god. Stop it. This is why no one likes Wingull in Palabar, seriously, I just... I. Oh my god. Yeah, I really need to go. It's really bothering me right now. I don't know if I got an encounter in the connecting cave. Because like, if I did, I totally just knocked it out or ran away. But I will have a look back and then we'll obviously go back there if I didn't and you guys will already know if I did or did not because you would have went back and checked but we got Wingull finally finally the Seagull Pokemon it makes its nest on steep sea cliffs riding up drafts it soars to great heights I'm just gonna call this no stupid That is all. I'm just gonna call it stupid. But, 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 it is time for another wonder trade. So let's get this trade underway. The struggle was way too real, you guys. Seriously, that was just like, it was almost aggravating. <laughs> I'm not even going to do like a recap of what Wingull has, obviously I'm guessing just off the top of my head I had Growl, Water Gun and Supersonic, that was it. Level 7 and it's stupid. So I feel bad for whoever's going to get this through one to trade, I apologise in advance but the show must go on. Just takes so long. I'm, I'm guessing it's my internet because sometimes it just takes forever to find a trade partner. I just don't. I don't, I don't understand. See, I don't know whether I should speed up through these sections because there's not really too too much to talk about when it comes to sitting here watching the find a trade screen. But we need a replacement for tor like Torchic or Ponyta because we've got two fire types in the team at the moment. And I really need to replace Squirtle because we lost Squirtle, which is our main water type. We've got Remoraid, which could be nice because we could have an Octillery and that could be pretty cool. Octillery action. Don't really see, see that all too often. But can we find a trade partner or what? Like, seriously. It's just like, what is happening? <laughs> there we go. Thank you, Ashley from the United States, Florida. <laughs> Can you come through with the goods, Ashley? Are you wanna trading out straight power today? Poochie Anna. See, I could be mad about that, but at the same time, I just gave her a wing goal, so I can't really be too mad about that, to be honest. So, we got a pitch channel. I'm cool with that. I'm totally cool with that. I, I do love rocking a mighty Anna in Hoenn, in the Hoenn region. So, 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 let's continue on down this way and not encounter a horde of Wingull. That would have been so much easier just to encounter a Spoink. Why couldn't we encounter a Spoink? But we had to encounter a horde. Oh, that's so frustrating. 
But let's continue on. Let's continue on. Okay. Hey, sweetie. Dream big is what I think. Listen to the music. Love it. I love it. You're looking at the future champion after all. Bring it on. Rising Star. Player. So that's like the Ace tra Trainer theme and the Rising Star theme. I love it. It's so good. She's an axe here. So let's fake it out. Cheap shot. Ooh, get wrecked. Crit, and we get the default flinch too. So, later, Zach. You. Good night. Awesome. The future champion, huh? Well, well, what? Perhaps that future champion stuff is all just a dream in the end. That's what I thought as well. Cool. So let's. Uh, well, we can't do that. Huh? the sign say trainer tips you can change the position of a pocket yeah okay thank you trainer tips so let's come back to that trainer let's just make our way to the next town and call it a day I think so you can counter a stink eh? a stink spray I should say rhymes left right and center you guys Okay, cool. So there's that item that you can get by using strength. What else we got here? I don't know. So we got this guy. I don't know what he wants. So we'll just stay away from him for now. Drifting. Ha like... I don't understand. We got that, that horde encounter, but there's just so many like single encounters here. We just happen to get a horde. It's just so annoying. Good thing. Good thing. I suck at these things. God damn it. I, I suck at these things. So let's go something like this. Start from the top and just work our way down. Okay. So that's no good. There's an item over there. We can't get that. I'll come back later, I guess. Okay. So what's going on? Nothing. Okay. Ambrick Town. Okay. Hi. Hi there, neighbor. Who's this? Serena. This is Ambrick Town. You just go through the aquarium to get to this large city, but... First, we should go to the fossil lab and have them tell us about fossils. We might even learn something about those mysterious stones related to mega evolution. Cool. So we need to go to the fossil lab. I'm going to heal up and we're going to call it a day here. So, in this episode, I need to go I need to go back and check and see in the connecting cave if I encountered something in there because if I did, we missed an encounter and that is my bad. But we did get the encounter on Route 7, and we got one on Route 8 in today's episode. So we didn't really crush too much due to Wonder Trading taking forever to do. But with that said, if you guys enjoyed today's episode of the Pokemon Y Wonderlock, be sure to drop a like down below, and I look forward to seeing you guys in episode number 13 or another one of my Pokemon videos. Thanks for watching. Peace.